you talked about uh, your teammate, uh, Dikembe Mutombo. He, I, I think he's just such a likable uh, personality from his voice <laughs> to his uh, finger, finger wag, signature finger wag. Can you perhaps share an anecdote about him during those years you guys shared a locker room together? Well, look, Dikembe has one of the biggest hearts that I've ever been around. Uh, Dikembe and I were very good friends when, you know, we played with the Nuggets and uh, by D Dikembe living in D.C. in the off season, and I'm from Virginia, um, we always used to drive from Denver um, back to the East Coast together. So we would coordinate, you know, what day we would leave. We would pack up our respective trucks and we would head across the plains together. Dikembe used to drive so fast. I mean, when we got out in Colorado, uh, you know, eastern Colorado and western Kansas, Dikembe was driving 90, 95 miles per hour. I was scared to death because I thought that if we had gotten caught, they were going to put us under the jail, particularly me because I wasn't Dikembe Mutombo. I remember trying to keep up with him, you know, on I-70 heading back east, and it was just virtually impossible. And he would always say, Steph, you need to keep up. Why are you driving so slow? As a big fella, the speed limit is 70 miles per hour, not 90. <laughs> so, <laughs> and, you know, those are just some of the, the, the great times that we had together. And, you know, those are, are memories that will last a lifetime. And, you know, we still keep in touch. And, you know, he's, he's truly a, a real and, and true friend of mine.